should be beginning very shortly. Um, their first game will be starting off on Town and City, and the matchup is going to be Ike Kirby. See how oppressive this set is going to be. I expect some oppression. Alright, starting off with a uh, running running up full hot neutral air. Sure. <laughs> See how these neutral airs pan out? A bunch of them. Yep, neutral air up tilt. Quick 22%. Neutral air up air. Damage is piling on. Best thing about Ike, he needs so few hits to get all of his damage. He just needs like three neutral airs and then one more neutral air to up air will seal it for uh, SK stock here. Yep, didn't quite react to that, but even then the air dodge, he covered it with the dash tag. Damn! Another up tilt. Alright, SK seems to have found something. Oh, look at this lock damage. That was amazing. That was an out outstanding combo from SK. And then he got a forward smash on top of that. It nearly killed Psychod, but he still needs to finish off this stock, and Psychod looks just fine. Ah, uh, yeah, that'll do it. Down air for sure will send him down to the depths and back on stage for the second stock. Okay, wow, that just clipped the shield. Forward tilt, the most reliable move in the entire game. Neutral air, forward air, that'll kill off the side. SK did a, SK pressed a button out of uh, hit stun there and just, that's gonna be outranged by a forward air. So definitely kill. Oh my goodness, this damage, all this damage. <laughs> okay, down air. That'll do. Ah, oh, another down air. Okay, the thing the thing I'm seeing from Psychod is that he goes off off stage. He he sees a lead and he'll he'll just he'll just do the hammy of stuff. Cause he feels like he can do it. I mean when you see that neutral air up air, I mean why wouldn't you go for some of the crazy stuff off stage? Down air? Oh that won't go off the side, but it nearly did. Ah, I feel like he could have turned to forward air after that, but oh well. Forward tilt, good or reliable? Yep. It will seal it. That is a game one. I think the difference between Psychod and like the rest of the sets uh, we have been we were seeing was that Psychod seems to be the first player where. There, there is clear oppression, and there's a sign that there, there's not going to be any easy adaptation in the next game. Like, I think SK can pile on a bit more in game two, but it's still looking super convincing for Psychod. That didn't look too close. It looked like Psychod just had everything down. Even when he was like going ham off stage, he was still fine. He was aware of that. But where are we going for game two? Town and city didn't work. What's the next option? Yoshi's Island? Sure. That's not that's not a that's not a great stage for it's not a great stage for Ike uh, Yoshi's Island, so I think it's a decent counter pick, but it's still something that <laughs> SK could easily lose on. All right, game two.
Neutral air up tilt. Good old 22. I like it as up tilt. SK should go Joker? I don't know. He'll probably go Joker for game three, I'm assuming, if this ends up as bad as I think it will. Which, I mean, it's already looking good for Psychod. Down throw. Won't get anything off of it. SK jumping out of his stun. The correct option there. But the forward are just covering the, covering the roll. Yep, neutral air. Up air. That'll do it. Just did a extremely risky inhale and dying for it like nothing. SK doesn't have an answer. I mean, he's building up the percent more, but what? There's going to be a lot more damage that Psychod is going to be building while he's dealing this damage, you know? While I said the extra credit from Kirby Dittos would need to be like 60% and then you're fine losing your stock, 40% is like just enough for Ike. 40% is enough for Ike. And even more than that, it's amazing. I mean, he hasn't lost his first stock yet and he just gets a neutral air back air. That'll, that'll kill easily off the side and his second stock is gone. He is, he is sitting so pretty, and I mean, even with the forward smash, what answer does SK have? <laughs> landing, landing down air, sure. Down tilt, forward air, classic. Neutral air, again, he's rolling... SK's rolling onto the stage and he is just getting clipped by the neutral air over and over again. He's getting clipped numerous times by this neutral air. He doesn't know how to work around it. He's not being patient enough to just wait out the wait out the neutral air, stay out of its range. He's getting into the range of the neutral air and dying for it, and also dying to that forward tilt. Psychon knew that he was going to roll because he ended up doing a lot of it in these past two games. Adapted to it forward till it get off the side. What what can SK do? That is a 2-0 lead. And it's looking like a possibly very convincing 3-0. Third game. I'm liking the idea of the Joker, honestly. Because this Kirby isn't working. But now we go to battle. Huh. I think I'll be honest with this and say this is an answer to. S this is an answer for someone who doesn't know the matchup. You're going to Battlefield of all places against Ike. Battlefield is Ike's best stage. I wonder what um, SK thought the answer was here. Like, what, what was... What did he think was the... Like, how did he, how did he think this was the right decision? I won't say it's, like, terrible that he tried going for this, but I'm questioning it. Does get arson from that upper. Neutral air again. Getting clipped while all of these huge range aerials. I mean, arson now has all the range on these aerials. I guess he can sort of compete in that aspect. But he's still not finding an answer to the neutral airs. That's a problem. He's going to die to a neutral air full hop up air from Psychod, and that's going to be his first stock. Potentially two stocks more of SK's bracket life. Down 
Down throw forward air. Down, down throw down air, buddy. Arson right through it. Alright, since... Okay, that'll be it. Tetrakarn, that is perfect. That is definitely the option that uh, he needed. An answer... At least some form of an answer for Ike's shenanigans is being able to Tetrakarn that Aether. He could still ditto SDN. He could still do it. Um, he just needs to get back to the... Um, he needs to face SDN wherever he ends up. But where SK is ending up is going off the top and back on stage. He's on his last stop. And it isn't looking any prettier for SK right now. It's looking super rough. Yep. Oh my goodness, that landing down there was sick. SK not finding his mark with all these aerials. Trying to go for these really hard reads, but I mean that up smash work. What other's gonna work? He's lost our send. And that's gonna be it. Yep, that'll do it. Psychod went off hard, and the result was he ended up winning for it. Getting that Aether 3 0 victory. That was super clean, and it looked like nothing.